Hello Aries and welcome to your May reading of 2017 let's get straight into it and to get a better understanding from where or what energies this reading comes from I advise you to read the description before you continue with the reading and anyway let's continue I am pulling a diamond and I first pull the issue then I pull the inside influence which you are unaware of this card is the influence from outside you are aware of this card is what is needed for the solution and this is the solution or what comes clear if you find yourself in these energies and I'm gonna pull one card afterwards uh, which will show you or find the point or to keep you zen towards resolving future paradoxes so let's continue with the issue or the question in your mind it is the card of death so the death card in this deck uh, will cheat and take the booklet this is the Los Carabeo deck a law of attraction and the death card is change like we know be willing to change your mentality and your habits in order to make your dream come true if one road leads to nowhere take another one and so the inside influence which you are unaware of is the six of wands and the six of wands is success I guess I am working with these cards for over six months but I can definitely need a lot of more practice so the six of wands in this deck is the reward the realization of your dream will occur when you least expect it perhaps it will be necessary to examine it up close or even reconstruct some parts of it and the influence you are aware of or coming from the outside is the tower card and the tower card we all know it's a sudden change or you are aware of sudden change coming visible in your life so the tower card defeat learn and draw resources from failure making them useful to your cause in this way you can start out in a better direction and what's needed for a solution to this change because with the death card and the tower there is definitely a change coming along your path and a re resurrection and definitely here with the completion card of wands you have the ten of wands I don't mind the reverse that much but it came in reversed it's the only card that came in reversed and it's the ten of wands for completion so I will read out the ten of, uh, of wands you have lots of wands here and two major arcanas so you have a fiery energy and uh, the ten is victory so whatever change or the tower will bring you it will what will be needed for a solution is the victory and the victory cards in this deck reads your dream becomes a reality bringing positive transformations to every sector of your life enjoy this unrepeatable moment so whatever the solution will bring you 
um, or what is needed for this solution it will bring you um, progress on every factors in your level and the last card is the wheel of fortune so the solution comes to the wheel of fortune meaning you are coming to a point in your life that will bring uh, a lot of a lot of opportunities I see it myself so the wheel of fortune in this deck I will read out quickly excuse me for the little delays the wheel of fortune or the wheel of life evaluate yourself on each aspect indicated by the wheel on a scale of 1 to 10 health, money, love, work, leisure, spirituality etc you will be able to understand your shortcomings what you would like and where potential dissatisfaction lies so you are you are coming to a point in your life of re-evaluation um, after a, a big change and a big reaping of rewards you have set in your life previously so now I will shuffle the deck for the Osho Zen Tarot cards and take out the card of Paradox that will um, be a point in the coming month of May in which you will if you put focus on it will bring out uh, paradoxes in your life and uh, paradoxes are uh, the points in your life when you have the most um, um, progress and resolving to matters which are unclear so I will pull out the card shuffle it a little more and the card here coming up sorry, oh, it's participation so the participation card I will show you here of the Osho Zen Tarot as you can see you have four members sitting around the table with their hands uh, all clear and uh, showing to each other so it will be come to a place that you come gather with other members maybe family or friends or even business partners and you will uh, come to uh, maybe a business or even further than that I will read out the, the the card of participation so we will look it up quite fast I hope the four of it should be fire yes page 84 Participation Commentary Each figure in this mandala holds the right hand up in an attitude of receiving and the left hand down in an attitude of giving. The whole circle creates a tremendous energy field that takes on the shape of the double dorje, the Tibetan symbol for the thunderbolt. The mandala has a quite la has a quality like that of the energy field that forms around a Buddha where all the individuals are taking part in a circle make a unique contribution to create a unified and vital whole it is like a flower whose wholeness is even more beautiful than the sum of its parts at the same time enhancing the beauty of each individual petal you have an opportunity to participate with others now to make your contribution to creating something greater and more beautiful than each of you could manage alone. Your participation will not nourish you, but will also contribute something precious to the whole. Participation. Have you ever seen night going? Very few people even become aware of things which are happening every day. Have you ever seen the evening coming? The midnight and its song. The sunrise and its beauty. We are behaving almost like blind people. In such a beautiful world, we are living in small ponds of our own misery. It is familiar, so even if somebody wants to pull you out, you struggle. 
you don't want to be pulled out of your misery, of your suffering. Otherwise, there is so much joy all around. You have just to be aware of it and to become a participant, not a spectator. Philosophy is speculation. Zen is participation. Participate in the night leaving. Participate in the evening coming. Participate in the stars and participate in the clouds. Make participation your lifestyle and the whole existence becomes such a joy, such an ecstasy, you could not have dreamed of a better universe. And that is your reading, Eris, I hope you liked it. Take care and see you in June.